Few people know that Bound Brook and Bridgewater sit beside one of New Jersey's largest and most dangerous Superfund sites, a sprawling 575-acre industrial complex whose contamination began in 1915 under the Calco Chemical Company and exploded after the American Cyanamid Company took over in 1929 transforming the area into a powerhouse that produced more than 800 chemicals for decades. To handle the waste, the plant dumped solvents, dyes, sludge, and toxic byproducts into 27 unlined lagoons, allowing carcinogens like benzene and volatile organic compounds to seep directly into soil and groundwater. A crisis made even worse because the site sits right along the Raritan River and above the Brunswick Aquifer, placing nearby homes and drinking water at constant risk. Pollution levels became so severe that the EPA added the site to the National Priorities List on September 1, 1983, triggering a massive long-term Superfund cleanup that continues today. Even though much of the chemical manufacturing shut down by 1999, and the buildings were demolished by 2000. Despite 140 acres being delisted for redevelopment, the remaining 435 acres still contain contaminated groundwater and legacy waste that require strict monitoring, making American cyanamids history a powerful reminder of how deeply industrial negligence can scar a community. Like and follow for more New Jersey history and uncovered environmental stories.